tastes perfect. Uh, let's go get some kids. Oh, Daddy, this is the coolest 
going to ever eat your birthday fit for a king. Yeah, Jimmy, and look at all your presents full of expensive items, and maybe one day you'll repay us like today. Mommy, which one is the stripper in? Uh, she's on the way. What? That, that's what Jimmy wanted for his birthday party. No, Marvin. Hey, Dad, since I'm 18 now, can I throw this glass cup against the wall and shatter it? I mean, I'd rather you didn't, but if that's what you want to do on your birthday party, then go for it, buddy, but please don't. Hmm. I've suddenly grown out of childish behavior. Wait, really? No. Oh, well, I, you know, that doesn't even make me mad because it's your birthday party, so just go, go crazy, Jeffy. It's all at the door. Stripper? Well, no, not yet. I, I'm, 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 it's your friends. Oh, my friends! Jeffy, your friends are here. Happy birthday, Jeffy! Yeah, happy birthday. Happy birthday, dude. He's probably so crazy. Thanks, guys. Good, I'm a king. Oh, wow, that crowd is so cool. It's Yeah, Marvin, you did say anything for Jeffy's birthday. Uh, I mean, 
18 is a lot of time. You sure you want 18? Yes. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, we'll sing it 18 times. And can everyone dress up like me? Wait, why would we dress up like you, Jeffy? Because it's my birthday. <laughs> Exclusive interview with him now. All right, everyone. I'm here with the now alive world renowned painter, Jacques Pierre Francois. So tell us, Jacques, why would you fake your own death? Uh, you see, paintings are worth more than the artist is dead, and I was drowning and gambling bets. So I fake my own death, and now my paintings are worth millions. Extraordinary. But how did you fake your death? You jumped off the bridge and we saw the splattered remains on the canvas. Well, that is quite simple. All I had to do was push a peg off the bridge, and when it splatters on the canvas, the body was unrecognizable. And I bought that painting for $200 million, and now that you're not dead, that painting's not worth five. That is, as you Americans say, a too bad to I'm going to slap that stupid little pipe cleaner mustache clean off your stupid face. And don't hit me to jail. Well, what about your son? He was supposed to inherit your multi-million dollar fortune. Ah, uh, yes. Sorry. Listen, son, if you are watching this, look into the camera. Look at your papa. Fuck off. Well, you heard it here first, folks. I know. $200 million. I will now celebrate my millions by eating one of your American hamburgers from the McDonald's King. Oh, wow, Marvin. Good thing it wasn't about the money. Otherwise, you'd be really upset right now, huh? He's not getting any of the money! I'm thinking it's Jimmy out there! Jeffy was going to share? Yes, I thought he gave a shit. I said, I am so mad. I'm going to go sell his cake away. I'm taking that damn king crab off his head. I'm only thinking of happy birthday once. Marvin, you're going to sing happy birthday to him 18 times on his birthday. Let's go. No, the only 18 thing that's happening is how old he's turning because he's out of the house. No, Marvin, you don't mean that. We're kicking him out of the house. You think I'm going to deal with him for free? He's not going to live until he's 30 or 40. I'll kill myself. Listen, I am going to go tell Jeffy that he is gone when he leaves his house. I don't know. We can sing him happy birthday once. Stop right here, stop right here. All right, what's the plan? Okay, we're gonna roll the windows down, and then you're gonna play some silly music so the kids think you're an ice cream truck. And then when the kids come out to get their free candy, you're gonna grab Jeffy, and I'm gonna jump in the driver's seat and speed off. Well, that's a good idea. I wish I would have thought about that. All right, roll your window down. Free candy, kids! We're dressed up just like you. Yeah, even tan. Oh, that's sick. It's like I'm Gru and you guys are my minions. We're going to get the ball on another unicorn boy. You guys hear that? It sounds like an ice cream truck. Ooh, ice cream? I want ice cream. Mother F an ice cream truck? This birthday is the tits. Let's go. Guys, I can't believe it. A free candy van. What a dream come true. I hope they have Starburst. Ooh, they better have sneakers, dude. I want M&M's. Guys, doesn't this seem a little suspicious? <laughs> It's a white van with free candy spray painted on it. That's like typical kidnapper stuff. Cody, nobody kidnaps people anymore. That's illegal. Yeah, there's cameras everywhere, dude. Yeah, nobody will go to jail for kidnapping. Uh, okay, okay, yeah. I guess you guys are right. This isn't sketchy at all. Cody, let's go get a free candy and shut up. Oh, here they come. All the kids are coming. Good. Then you tell the kids they have to go to the back to get the candy, and then you grab Jeffy and I'll speed off. All right, get it. All right, Jeffy. Let's hurry up and sing happy birthday, and then you're getting the hell out of the house. 
Jeffy, did you like your birthday today? Well, you guys had me in the first But major donkey balls. What was wrong with the second half? Well, for starters, all the presents downstairs were just empty boxes wrapped with wrapping paper, and Daddy ran away. Well, you know, Jeffy, I think your dad's going through a midlife crisis today. Today? Of all days? Maybe he's at the store getting you real presents since your gift bags were empty. We can only hope. Well, do you want to watch some TV, Jeffy? Ooh, well, since I'm 18 now, can we watch naughty shows? I'm talking full frontal. No, Jeffy, let's watch the news. Uh... Breaking news! A prisoner in a maximum security prison has escaped. Please be on the lookout for this woman pictured here. Her name is Nancy. Real mommy escaped from prison? Uh, Jeffy, let's watch something else. Nudity? No, Jeffy. Mommy, what if real mommy comes and tries to kidnap me? We wouldn't let that happen. You promise? I promise. Okay, good. Um, now where's Marvin? I'm gonna give him a call. Nipple time! Jeffy, change the channel. Mommy, look at these rocking cans. Jeffy, change the channel now. Jeffy, stop it. Oh, he didn't answer. Well, he's missing a good show. Jeffy, I'm changing the channel. <sighs> okay, let me see Jeffy. He's right here. He is mommy. Wait a minute. What are you guys doing? Let me go. This isn't Jeffy. Sure it is. See the blue helmet and the yellow shirt? No, no, no. This isn't Jeffy. This is somebody else with a blue helmet and yellow shirt. <sighs> Listen, this is too hard. Can we try something easier? Wait, wait. You're Jeffy's mom. Wait a minute. You're the bozo who put me in jail. Well, no, no. You put yourself in jail, but I had nothing to do with it. Okay, look. I don't want you. I wanted Jeffy so I could take his millions of dollars that I rightly deserve. Well, good luck getting that money because his dad's not dead. He's actually alive and he's not giving Jeffy any of the money. <laughs> nice try. You really expect me to believe that? Wait, it's on the news. Just turn it on. Yeah, 
right. You'll say anything to get me to let you go. No, I have a better idea for you. I'm gonna hold you hostage until Jeffy gives me that money. He doesn't have the money. Well, if he doesn't give me the money, you're dead. <laughs> hey, can I use your phone? Sure. I gotta call his family. All right, what's Jeffy's number? Jeffy's number? Why do you need his number? Because I'm gonna call Jeffy and you're gonna tell him you're kidnapped and that you're gonna die if he doesn't give me that money. He's not gonna believe me. Well, we're gonna try anyway. Oh, okay, his, his number is... Yeah. I'm changing the channel, yeah. Jeffy! No, you're not! I've waited 18 years to watch shows like this! You're not gonna take this from me! You can wait a little longer! Wait, wait, wait! My phone's ringing! Maybe it's Marvin! No, it's not my phone! Yeah, it's my phone. Yeah, hello? You have reached the plug. Please, shibby. Shibby! Go on to walk. Uh, Jeffy, it's, it's me. Say shibby. What? Say shibby. Uh, shibby. What, what was that? Was it some kind of cold? No, he told me to do that before I talked. I, did you see him? I told you, did it. Uh, 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 hey, Jeffy, it's, it's me, Marvin. Uh, I was kidnapped. Sorry, wrong number. What? Who was that, Jeffy? It was some salesman trying to sell me a car's extended warranty. But you don't have a car. Exactly why I hung up on him. Aw, oh, you're so smart, Jeffy. I don't know. What'd he say? Oh, uh, he thought it was a wrong number. Like, damn it, make him believe you or I'll shoot you in the head. Oh, yeah, call my wife, call my wife. Okay. Jeffy, hold on, my phone's ringing. It's a block number, hello? Talking no funny business. Uh, hey, baby. Marvin, where are you? Why are you calling from a block number? Oh, it's a long story, so I got... Oh, my God, are you calling from a side chick's phone? What side chick would I have? Oh, listen, baby, look, I'm kidnapped, and they want millions of dollars, so can you... Marvin, is this your sick way of trying to make money because Jeffy's dad really isn't dead? Wait, he's not? But baby, no, I'm not trying to make money. I, I can't believe you abandoned Jeffy on his birthday. You're a deadbeat dad. No, no I'm kidnapped. I didn't abandon... I guess just come home whenever you feel like it. I got... Okay, what'd she say? Uh, she thinks I'm a deadbeat dad and I left Jeffy on his birthday. Oh, God damn it! that's it, I'm killing him, get my gun. Oh, no, 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 don't get the gun, oh, okay, how about one of you call him, because you guys have scary voices, so who has a scarier voice? She does. Uh, okay. Mommy, is my real dad really alive? Yes, he is, Jeffy. Well, I want to meet him. No, I don't think you do, just don't watch the news. No, I want to meet him, because I bet real daddy wouldn't leave me in my own birthday party. I don't know about that, Jiffy. Wait, my phone's ringing. I bet it's Marvin. What do you want, Marvin? If you ever want to see Marvin again, you'll give me five million dollars. Wait, this isn't Marvin. No, it's not. And if you ever want to see Marvin again, give me five million dollars. What's going on? Okay, I kidnapped Marvin. And if you want to see him again, you will give me five million dollars. But I don't have five million dollars. Well, then I guess you're not going to see Marvin again. What, should I kill him now? No, don't do that. Um, I'll just call you back in five minutes. What? Okay. Wait, but uh, you called from a block number, so I don't have your number. Oh, yeah. Hold on. What, what is your number? Mine? No, the guy who's tied up. What's his number? What? No, I was being sarcastic. Yes, your number. Well, then you should have said something. You should have said, hey, Screwball, what's your phone number? Hey, Screwball. What? What is your phone number? 555-555-5556. It's... It's all fives with the six at the end. You can't screw it up. Okay, I'll, I'll call back in five minutes, okay? Jimmy, your dad's been kidnapped! Which one? Uh, the Marvin! Oh, well, good. He deserved it. He left me at my birthday party. Oh, I'm gonna call the cops. What'd they say? They're gonna call me back. But if they don't call me back in five minutes, I'm killing you. Oh, uh, they're gonna call back. Hey, Lena, somebody called the cops, and I brought backup, because in case you haven't heard, there's a goon on the loose, and she's a real rascal, that goon. So have you seen any goons? What about you, kid? You look like you've seen a goon or two. That goon goon kidnapped my husband. It's the woman that escaped from prison that was on the news. I'm sorry, what? The woman on the news that escaped from hey, prison. See, I just distinctly didn't hear you say happy birthday to the birthday boy. Oh, is it your birthday today? Nobody loves me. I'm so sorry. It's just, it's my son's birthday today, so. Oh, yeah. God, I hate people who have the same birthday as me. I wish they'd all die. Can we focus here, please? This woman kidnapped my husband. She's asking for $5 million or so she's gonna kill him. Wait, you were contacted by the woman who escaped from prison? You hear that, Simmons? We have a lead. We have a lead? We have a lead. So where is she? I don't know. She called from a blocked phone number. A blocked phone number. We lost the lead. We lost the lead. We lost the lead. But she did give me her phone number. She gave you a phone number? She gave you a phone number? She gave you her phone number. Okay, great. So we can just call her. So we can just call her. So we no, no, can... Simmons, Simmons, stop. Stop singing. It's starting to piss me off. Okay, so we can just call her and hear her demands. Yes, but I already told you her demand. She wants $5 million or she's going to kill Marvin. Hey, listen, you've never met a negotiator like me. I can get that price way down. You should have seen me get my Hyundai Sonata. I got them to take five grand off the sticker. Oh, man, it was great. Hey, you, you want to ride in my Hyundai Sonata? No, please, can we just focus and no, call this 
Oh, my God, I take a right way. not a good uh, There she is. That's my baby. It's very nice. Now, can we... It is very nice. I insist you take a ride in her. No, that's not necessary. Can we please oh, go Oh, it's call? very necessary. When you feel the seats are going to be in heaven. I'll take your word for it, please. Oh, let's you don't call. have to take my word for it. Come on, let's take a ride. Uh, Oh, man, I love being in this car. It's way more comfy than the cop car, which I have to go get in soon. Yes, this car's very impressive. Now, can we please this go This car back? has so many features. Like, check this out. You're going to love this. You know what that is? That's a blind spot camera. So if some little brat tries running up on me while I'm turning, I can see him. It's very convenient. Can we go back inside? Yeah, and I got all of these features for a steal at the Hyundai Sunday sales event. I'm so happy for you. Can we please go call Jeffy's? I think Jeffy's? we should take a quick little ride around the neighborhood. No! Yeah, come on, come on, you'll love it. Uh, oh, man, how lucky are you? You got to ride my Sonata. Not a lot of people get to do that. Not even my daughter, you know, because she eats crackers and the crumbs get between the seats. Oh, big mess. Can we please? Huge mess. Can we please? And then you got to get in there with a vacuum, and that takes forever. And it's can like, we please? And then you got to pay the vacuum with quarters, and that just sucks. Can we please call the woman now? Oh, yeah, we can call her. Just hold on. It's ringing. Hello? Hey there, ma'am. I just wanted to let you know that this is the police and you're going to jail, bitch. <laughs> Say hi, Simmons. Hi, Simmons. No, Simmons, you're supposed to... Just call her a bitch. Bitch! You hear that? That's my buddy Simmons and he's gonna kick your ass. I'll oh, shut sure up. Yeah, he'll hit a woman. He doesn't care. I don't care. He doesn't care. Oh, no, you're not. Because I got a hostage. Oh, man, I hate when they have hostages. What do you want? I want five million dollars. You're gonna meet me in the field. Y you know the one. Oh, yeah, of course I know the field. It's the field. It's the one field. You're gonna meet me in the field in an hour with five million dollars and Jeffy, because I want to say hi to him. Uh, okay, okay, but but hear me out. How about three million dollars? No, it's five million dollars or I kill this guy right now. Oh, damn, you're not playing, so I don't get the Hyundai Sunday sales event price? No. O okay. Simmons, when we get there, we're gonna shoot her in the face. And no weapons! Oh, come on, that's not fair! So do we have a deal? Okay, stupid. I didn't get anything out of that phone call. I'm sorry, mate. What did she say? She wants us to meet her in the field in an hour with $5 million and Jeffy. But we don't have $5 million. Yeah, I know. So when she gets there, you and I are just going to tackle her. I mean, it's two against one, and she's had no weapons, so I think we can take her. Yeah. Come on, Jeffy, let's go see her. So what's happening? We're going to meet the cops and Jeffy in an hour to trade you for the money. Yes, screwball. Why would we meet with the cops? Wouldn't they just shoot us? No, because I told them no weapons. Oh, that's smart. But guess who's gonna bring their gun? Who? Me! Well, that's not fair. Shouldn't you tell them so it's fair? No, I don't care if it's fair. Come on, we're going. Okay. Okay, Simmons, I'm assuming they're in the van that says free candy on it. Oh, mate, you think we can get some free candy? I don't think they have any free candy, Simmons. Well, why would they put it on the van if it's not true? I'm going to take a wild guess and say it so they can kidnap people. But that's illegal! I know, and that's why we're going to arrest them. So what we're going to do is we're going to get out of the van, and we're going to play good cop. We're going to be like, hey, we got your money, and then bam, we whoop her ass. And then we save Marvin, we get the key to the city, and the chief is going to give us promotions. Sounds good, mate. All right, Jeffy, you stay here. All right, bitch. Yeah! So show me the money or I'm gonna blow his head off. That's not fair. That's not fair. That's not fair. We said no weapons. We were gonna beat your ass. Huh? You really thought I was stupid enough not to bring a gun? Now show me the money or I'm gonna shoot him and all of you. <laughs> well, you see, it's actually kind of a funny story because we didn't bring the money because me and Simmons thought we could beat you up. All right, that's it. I'm killing him. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Don't, don't shoot him. We, we have Jeffy in the back of the car. You wanted him, right? Okay. Hand over Jeffy. Uh, Jeffy, could you come out of the car? Hey, Mommy. Jeffy, run! Hey, Jeffy. Mommy missed you. Now come to Mommy. Go. Uh, uh, hey, at least we saved Marvin, right? Go on, Jeffy. Oh. Oh, you're not gonna let her take Jeffy, are you? We don't have any weapons, bro. I don't know what you want us to do. Hey, Jeffy. Happy birthday. Uh, okay, since you didn't bring my money, I'm taking Jeffy with me. And whenever you want to stop playing games, maybe we can make another deal. Come on. Oh, Daddy, help me! She took him. She really just took him. I mean, hey, at least you don't have to deal with him anymore. Well, I know, but, like, I don't want anything bad to happen to him. Why? What do you care? You're always complaining about him anyway. Well, I know, I just...
I still care about him. Yeah, I mean, look on the bright side. At least it's a nice day for it. You know, it's not too hot, not too cold. You know, if my kid were to get kidnapped, I'd want it to be in weather like this. True. Wait, you guys gotta do something about chase the bandits! We can't do anything, man. We don't have any weapons, and she has a handgun. She could shoot all of us. Wait, mate, don't we have a sniper rifle in the trunk of the car? Oh, yeah, we do have a sniper rifle in the trunk of the car. Okay, Simmons, I want you to camp out somewhere. Get up in one of these trees and shoot out her tires. On it. Okay, Marvin, me and you are gonna chase that van down. Come on! Let's go! <sighs> Someone's gonna die today. All right, Marvin, you're about to see how I drove on my driver's test when I was 16. Poorly. There she is! There she is! Catch up with her! I'm trying, man! She is driving like crazy. I guess I can add reckless driving to the list of charges. You know, I can make corny cop buttons because we're in a police chain. Let's just focus on the road, okay? Oh, Jeffy, I'm sick of you. I never loved you. You were an accident. After I get my money, I'm going to kill you and bury you in the deepest hole I can find. And then I'm going to kill your other family. Dad, help me! Ram her! You should ram her! Okay, I'm going to do a pit maneuver. Yeah, go! Wait, 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 what's going on? What's going on? Gas. We're out of gas! We should get the wind! Can we get more gas? Hmm, I don't see any gas stations in this fucking field, do you? Oh, no, but she's getting away! It's up to Simmons now. Simmons, I need you to shoot those tires out right now! Hold on it, mate! Oh, still, you bastard! Uh, Simmons? You are only supposed to shoot the tires. Whoops. Jeffy's dead. Uh, uh, uh d -d dispatch. We, we we need we need an ambulance and a fire truck. Just 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 all of it. Get out here now. Marvin. Oh my God, Marvin! Thank God you're okay and no one was hurt. Uh, Simmons, I think we should probably leave. Why? This is about to be really sad. Marvin, where's Jeffy? Uh, he's a. Uh... He's not coming back, baby. What do you mean he isn't coming back? Where is he? His, uh, his, his mom took him. No, she didn't. Marvin, we have to go back there. We have to go get him. Get the cops. No, he, he, he's dead, baby. He's dead? What are you talking about, Marvin? Listen, the, the mom took him in the van, and the, the van exploded, and, and Jeffy died in the explosion. Exploded? No! No, Marvin! Jeffy can't be gone! No, he just can't! He can't! He, you go get Jeffy! He's dead, baby! He's dead! Simmons, I feel bad, but you must feel way worse, because you fucking suck at shooting. This was entirely your fault. It was a moving target, mate! Gas cap? Tire. Big difference, Simmons. But they're both round. <sighs> okay, Simmons, let's just go. Hey, I'm so happy I was back! I know, baby, I miss Jeffy too. <laughs> I wish I could just hear him do that annoying ugh sound one more time. <laughs> Marvin, that was a really good impression. What? That wasn't me, I thought it was you. What? Don't be sad, Daddy. It's not like you had to walk 50 miles in the dark getting eaten by mosquitoes on your birthday. Well, Jeffy, you're alive! Oh my god! Yeah, I jumped out of the back of the van before it exploded. Well, what? Yeah, this is what happened. Um, uh, hey, we're almost out of gas. Then find the gas station. Well, Jeffy, Jeffy, no! Jeffy, Jeffy! Listen, I know you're 18, but you don't have to move out of the house. You can stay here as long as you want because I can't imagine life without you because I've gotten so used to you. I know I know, I was mad to you today on your birthday, but that was just because I thought we were getting money, but I don't care about the money. I, I just want you, Jeffy. I love you so much. Aww. Well, let me do, Mommy and Daddy, but I didn't plan on going anywhere. 
Who's at the door? Hold on. Hello? Hey. What, what are you doing here? I just wanted to say I'm sorry. Well, I thought you died. You were driving the van. No, I heard a gunshot and I got scared and jumped out. Uh, hey, we're almost out of gas. <laughs> then find the gas station. Oh, Jimmy, Jimmy, no, Jimmy, Jimmy. Oh, gunshots. I'm out of here. So, do you accept my apology? Well, get out of here. I don't want to see you ever again. I'm calling the cops right now. Who was at the door, Marvin? It was one of the kidnappers. What? I already called the cops. Hey there, you call me? Oh, hey, you're not dead. How the hell did that happen? Oh, listen, listen, one of the kidnappers at the door, he survived. Oh, hey, that means nobody died today. Well, actually, I shot my mom in the face before the van exploded. Oh, okay. Well, with the explosion, there's no trace of the body. So that means no paperwork from me. And that's the best birthday present I could ask for. This video is about me. It should have been called Brooklyn Guy's 45th birthday. No balls, name it that. Okay, I'm done and I don't react to anything. But on um, this it. Goodbye. See you later. Peace. And peace.